Hello, it's me, Hi Oscar from Marijuana Garden. Airbus is flying taxi, what is it? One by the push of a button, vehicles can fly over traffic jams. Also, people would be able to book autonomous flying taxis using a mobile app. To it is the secret flying car project dubbed Vahana. Three Vahana is a Sanskrit word that refers to the vehicle or mount of a god, who is set for this experiment. One Airbus. To it is set to test its autonomous airborne taxi prototype for one passenger by the end of 2017. Tom Anders in conference with DLD we are in an experimentation phase, we take this development very seriously. With flying, you don't need to pour billions into concrete bridges and roads, he added. Benefits about this project One such technologies would have to be cleaned to avoid further polluting congested cities, and that using skies could help reduce costs for city infrastructure planners. To in a not-too-distant future, we'll use our smartphones to book a fully automated flying taxi that will land outside our front door without any pilot. 3-1 Find AR Big Cities will have flying cars making their way along roads in the sky. Other companies with similar prototype 1 Terra Future 2 Aeromobile 3, Ehang. Technology Operations 1, it will take off and land vertically. Cue the Jetsons references. 2, the aircraft has 8 rotors on 2 sets of wings, both of which tilt depending on whether the car is flying vertically or horizontally. 3, there's room for a single passenger under a canopy that retracts like a visor. For the aircraft will be deployed like a taxi, making it the air taxi version of Uber. Disadvantages One airspace in North America and Europe is tightly regulated, making it extremely difficult for any company to gain permission for commercial flight, especially in dense urban environments. Two idea of autonomous aircraft would probably strike most passengers as a recipe for disaster. What about safety of the passenger? One since Vahana has only one room for a single passenger, and there's an onboard ballistic parachute that works even at low altitudes. Conclusion 1, A3 hopes to have a full-size prototype ready to fly by the end of 2017, and an actual demonstrator is scheduled to follow by 2020. Two full automation also enables us to make our aircraft as small and light as possible and will significantly reduce manufacturing costs.